Luke Thomas for MMA Fighting here at Madison Square Garden for a very momentous occasion next to UFC CEO Lorenzo Fertitta. Lorenzo, I guess I'll just open up by saying congratulations. It was a very festive mood here today. What is your mood like? Um, tranquil? Excited? How would you characterize it? You know, obviously excited, definitely excited, but I think it's one of those uh, things where we finally get this done and it's very rare that you get a chance to kind of step back and reflect, reflect on everything that's happened since 2001. You know, we literally went state by state. Uh, we're able to get MMA regulated all across the United States, for the, for the most part, all across the world. But you don't really think about it. You're just kind of doing things. But when I finally got to the arena today, we took pictures with the athletes uh, in the center of the arena. And that's when it kind of hit me. I'm like, wow, um, it's been a long, hard battle, but we're finally here. And, uh, you know, kind of take two seconds to let it sink in. And now it's back to business. How long did you know that November 12th date was the one you were targeting? Has that been in the works for months, weeks, days? We've had a lot of dates that seem to keep moving out. You know, as you know, I think the event that's happening on the 23rd in Vegas was originally scheduled for Madison Square Garden. Obviously, for obvious reasons, we had to change that. Um, we've been working on November 12th now for about a month or two. You know, getting a date at MSG is no easy deal. I mean, this is one of the busiest arenas in the world, obviously. So uh, we were able to get that date. We said, we'll do it, lock it in, and that's what we're shooting for. Ronda Rousey, is she going to be on that card? Um, certainly a possibility. Um, nothing has been determined yet. Um, you know, we'll kind of see what happens. I can tell you that, you know, whatever card uh, we do end up bringing, it will be massive. It'll be a big card with our biggest names. Can you guarantee a title fight will be on there? Yes, I would say that that will, that will happen. And uh, you said there's going to be an upstate announcement in a couple of weeks. Have you narrowed the field about what you're looking for upstate? Yeah, I mean, there's a number of cities that, that we think will be good markets for us. Obviously, Buffalo, Syracuse, Rochester, uh, Albany, uh, even Utica, we're talking about going to this, where Matt Hamill's from. Um, but I think for the event before the end of the year, it's probably between Rochester and Albany. Um, but we got to figure out what venue's available, what day's available, so we got to shuffle the schedule around a bit. And just to clarify, it would probably be a pay-per-view here and a fight night upstate. Is that correct? That's what we're thinking, yes. I, I don't want to bring in bad news, but I actually think it's sort of relevant that we're signing into regulation, or you know, the governor signing into regulation today. That was obviously the tragedy in Ireland. There's a lot of unknowns there, but it sort of seems to me the UFC's work, it's not your responsibility, but if something bad happens somewhere else, it, it can bleed over into the rest of MMA. Do you guys have any intent on maybe tackling the problem in Ireland to see if there's any way you can get the government to oversee it there? Yeah, I mean, we've always, as you know, that's been kind of our mantra. We run towards regulation. We would love to be able to sit down, work with the authorities in Ireland, in the UK, so that not just our events, but all of the events are properly regulated. Once again, I don't know exactly what happened in that event. Obviously, everybody's still trying to figure that out. But that's the reason that, that we want regulation, so that there's standards, so that it's the same everywhere. And we would certainly think that that would be a good idea. Well, thank you for your time. Congratulations again, and uh, I guess I'll see you on November 12th. Yep, November 12th, absolutely.